Race 7 of the BMW IBSF two-man bobsleigh World Cup in Innsbruck in Austria. Heading into the second heat with 20 sleds from 11 nations. 22-year-old Swiss Michael Vogt in fifth place after the first of the two heats. A week earlier, he'd finished tied for fourth on Saturday. An unexpectedly poor 15th on Sunday, but he guaranteed himself another top five finish. Ahead of him, a newcomer, Hans-Peter Hanninghofer, making his first ever World Cup start for Germany. The bearded giant had only competed in about a dozen bobsled races up to this point, but he was in shooting for the medals. A good second heat would keep him ahead of Vogt, guaranteed at least a fourth place finish on his World Cup debut. Hanikoffer was just two hundreds behind Oskar's Kibermanis of Latvia after the first heat. The Latvian had had two bronze medals a week earlier in Innsbruck and looked to be on target for a third. A quarter of a second up midway down the run, he didn't lose speed towards the finish line. A third place at least guaranteed. Three men were on the podium a week ago. Oscars Kivermanis, Johannes Lochner and Francesco Friedrich. They were all in the top three on Saturday. Hansi Lochner, after a slightly disappointing top end to the track, dropped behind Kivermanis and despite the best speed, couldn't fight back. He slipped to second. Kivermanis guaranteed at least a silver, Lochner at least a bronze. And then Francesco Friedrich with Alexander Schuller. They'd set a new track record in the first heat. They were chasing the start record in the second heat. They came up 200 shy of that, but dominated proceedings despite a mistake in corner nine to take an emphatic win. The 32nd of Friedrich's two-man career. Friedrich winning by nearly seven tenths ahead of Kiebermanis and Lochner. Tight battles all the way down the order except for gold and Friedrich leads the World Cup with one more race to go in Innsbruck.